traveling with this thing about to show you my number one vendor for t-shirts any apparel you need for your brand we're in florida what do you mean I, I can't believe i left that freaking camera on the plane this is our million box right there give me some tips about the perfect logo Today we're in sunny Davie, Florida. I'm gonna show you the company that does my t-shirts for my roofing company and the roofing insides. Uh, Roger, tell me about your business. I know you have two names, Embroid Me and 10 Minute. 10 Minute Tea. 10 Minute Tea. What's behind 10 Minute Tea? Is it your brand? Is it franchise? Well, the 10 Minute Tea is my brand. Uh, we went online about a year and a half ago, uh, just uh, set up for people to basically we build stores for any company that wants to do their marketing materials their clothing uh, t-shirts whatever they want you're talking about online stores online stores and basically what we do is we 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 give them the ability to order easily multiple locations it, you know they can just order from it's all coming from the same location so if you order and you're in Texas or Maryland or Pennsylvania you order the products to your store or to your people that work for you, it's going to come. It's going to look the same. It's going to be the same price, which is going to be a good a, a good price set way before you start doing any of this. And it just makes it nice and organized for your printing materials, your embroidery materials, your screen printing materials, and any promo products that you might want. The roofing insights will say, "Talk is cheap. Show us around. We want to see it." Well, come on, come and look. So you stitching, do you have my shirts ready? We're, because we're, I want to put my shirt in my video. How about that? You want to do it right now? Yeah. All right. Well, we're gonna, we, we preset this up. Okay. So I don't want to, you know, we put your product here and we're going to run some shirts. We staged it, he said. Yeah, we staged this part. But we just want to make sure that, you know, so we, we've, right. we've already done through the preliminary um, uh, approvals so that everything is approved, which takes a little bit of time, but not very long. He's approved his logos, and now we're going to move forward with some products for him. Amber approved my logos. <laughs> well, you know... Maybe, I hope Amber you didn't mess up. Well, she's the boss, so... <laughs> this is so cool. How much something like this cost? Like, what's this machine cost? This machine is a $50,000 machine. $50,000? 50, yeah. Five zero. 50000 How many do you have? Well, we have five. Right. Let's so, put our million box right there. We can do about 1,500 pieces a day. We run two shifts. Two so shift. we run two shifts. You, you run overnight shift or overnight something? Overnight shift. We, we have another shift that comes in at five o'clock in the afternoon and wow. runs to about two o'clock in the morning. So we do a lot of product here. Um, the other thing that's so great is that the artwork, like let's say we make your art and we, we take your art and we put it up on the cloud. So it stays up there and it doesn't, it, we don't, get it mixed up with anybody else's and basically what happens i is, see my logo right there yeah your logo's here yeah and can you show him so basically what they do is they pull your logo up we've created your logo already we pull it up and we take a piece of paper and scan it with these scanners these scanners and the logo goes right up onto the machine so there's no human error is cut down a lot on your product so the speed accuracy of what we do is always um, you know, really helpful when we keep it. Who on the fixes top. these machines if something broke? Do you have like outside person coming in and look at this? This is so cool. Yeah, so right now it's telling you exactly where it is on the machine, what color thread. It's only gonna it's white color, but it's a number three head. So that's how it's set up and it's doing 600, 600 thread per minute. So it takes about, let's say you have 3,200, so you have about five minutes worth of, six minutes worth of sewing to do your shirt. Now the other thing is that we use a, a, a Solvi, which makes it really lay nice on the shirt. We have a high, uh, this is a high performance shirt, so we always use the best materials underneath, behind the scenes to keep a nice uh, product all the time. We're gonna do about, one every five minutes, six every five minutes. So this is what I was talking about on the screen, on the scan. So we would basically scan this 
and it comes down from the cloud and it goes onto the machine directly. So there's no people involved in that part of it. Okay, so we had a little break right here. We're gonna, so sometimes it breaks, it, it uh -oh. which is not a problem, breaks the thread. Looks like a problem for me. Breaking uh, <laughs> We just re th we thread it and get it started again. Part of the business. Part of the business. So basically what he did is he backed it up a couple of steps and then moved it forward. Um, who fixes the machines? This is critical in the business. Uh, my guy that runs the operation, he can fix the machines, but I also have a maintenance program on each of these machines. I, get, I have them come in at least once a month, sometimes more, and they do a, a, a steady maintenance. We check our, pro, our product, how we output, and what the, what the logos are looking like. So there's always fine tune adjustments on these products. One of our biggest clients is a yacht, yacht company. And so they're, you know, these yachts are very, they, we do a lot of work for them. And so they're, they're, they're just a highly, um, you know, quality has to be the top priority for us. And so everybody else sort of benefits from that, being that our quality is at a level that it is. What's and fully promoted? Well, Fully Promoted is a new company name. We just started. Uh, you keep coming up with the new names. I know it, I know it. It used to be Embroid Me, but the, the main company changed about, I don't know, a year or two ago, but I'm just doing the process now, so. But it, it, it's just, uh, it, it just, it sort of tells the story of what we do. So Fully Promoted is we're just promoting your business. Sure. And, and I think it's a better name than the old name. So it just gives us a little bit more opportunity. Have you seen the difference already with a, just the name change, fully promoted versus embroid me? Well, I think a lot of times people look at us differently uh, now that the, you know, embroid me was sort of like, you know, embroidery. So we were just sort of pigeonholed Smaller into niche. that, yeah, niche business. This is more like, um, you know, any kind of promotion, any kind of promotional products, any, um, you know, make sure your business is promoted properly, you know. Well, you don't want to get your shirt on right now? Yeah. Okay. How do you clean it? What's next? Well, she's going to take, they're going to take these all off. And they take them off there. You want me to do one? Yeah, sure. Monica can do it. Right, so normally we would just send the other, we would have the other six ready and we would just put them on right away. And so we would run continuously and then clean at the same time. So basically how we do it is we have four machines running and three operating it. So three people operating, two sewing and one cleaning. So we want to step down here and see how she's so doing. How you, okay, it's just pretty much. Yeah, they're cleaning, trimming. There's a lot of, and there's uh, on the back side of it, which all of these shirts, have a back. This is large. Uh, what size is this one? Um, large. That's a large. All right. So it's ready to go. So well, there. Put it on. You want to try it on? Yeah. Sure. This is water. What happens sure. is you put a little bit of liquid on there, and it, it it basically takes the ring mark off, and then it dries quickly. I like the look of that. That's a good looking logo. What do you think? That is a good looking logo. All right. Um, I'll go put it on okay. real quick. Okay. All right. Look at that, ready for business. So this area here is a uh, shipping and receiving. So basically everything comes in and it's counted and it's got to go into different locations. So how many shirts do you usually keep here? I see a lot of boxes. You're talking about a couple thousand, 10,000? We, 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 we can do about, we do about 10,000 pieces a day, depending on which, which jobs. So we can have you know, tens of thousands of shirts here at any given time. But typically, typically we try, we try to, we don't stock a lot. What we do is we, we bring it in when it's needed. So then you don't have to stock each size and each color and all that. So, you know, if somebody puts an order in, I can have most of the, most of everything within one day. So he's uh, taping the boxes over there for, for shipping out. So basically it comes in, it, 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 
is counted and set into the different locations. So if it's going to the embroidery department, if it's going to the screen printing department, if it's going into the garment printing, uh, anything that comes in, in and out has to be counted, sorted, and put in its proper place. So when it's finished, it comes back out here and it gets tagged, either shipped or the customer comes and picks it up. I like this shirt on you. What kind of shirt is that? This is a Nike. Nike? Yeah. Just uh, what quality? Is it the dry fit? This or? is a dry fit Nike. So Nike, we do all the brands. Nike, Under Armour, Adidas, um, and then the regular brands like this. Um, the so you Sportex. buy directly from Nike and resell well, them? Or? Most of it is the, 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 the there's, a, there's some major companies that do this distribution and they do multiple brands. And it's better to just, you know, we deal with them. Um, they, have, they, they have gigantic buying power. We have big buying power because there's about 160 locations that we, we, we're working with. So we have great buying power. So our, our competition is a little bit of a disadvantage because of the size that we are. We're a small company, but we also have big buying power because we have a group of 160 stores. So. Wow. Yeah. Oh, I see some numbers in here. Looks like you've been a leader in sales for quite some years. Well, we know we started off small and we would do 50,000 in a month. And then, um, you know, over what the years, was that? this is probably, um, let's see, this is 2012. Oh. Okay. So um, now we do, we're up into the $250,000 a month, which um, I think this was in 2018. Um, we do somewhere in this general range a lot in this 200 to 250,000. Yeah, usually monthly. Yeah, we're gonna double it for you. That sounds good. <laughs> that sounds good. We have the capacity, the capacity to do it for sure. Uh, what's this machine? This is a machine that we have. This is a small embroidery machine that uh, sometimes uh, we 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 were involved in some shows that will go out and do a show. Uh, so, and we work with- uh, Do big, it on the spot or something? Yeah, Macy's, um, a lot of different companies that uh, want you and they, you bring them out and then they, we do embroidery on the spot. So they'll send a Saturday or a Sunday and, and just do whatever designs that the customer wants or their names or whatever on their products. It's kind of a popular thing throughout the country. The, the company we do a lot of business with is out of New York City and they, they do shows all over the country. So we, we do them for them. Love it. Yeah, it's good. You're gonna take us back to the warehouse? Yeah, come on back. So this is sort of the internet department and the promotional products department. It's a little bit, since the COVID, we sort of, um, some people working at home, some people are working, you know, different shifts. But basically we run our internet department from here. And we also internet sales, internet sales with the 10 minute tea, you know, um, it's, uh, you know, it's a big thing that we've been doing in the last year, basically it's pushing for multiple, uh, uh, companies to go on, on our platform. It's just cheaper for them and much more organized. Like I said before, they are, you know, basically everybody that we put on is very happy with it. They are, uh, it make, it takes all the, you know, the, the ordering, it ordering makes it, easier. It makes it so much the same for us. Yeah, it. you guys did it too, yep. and it, it, it just makes a big difference. Once it gets up and running, it, you'll see that it's better and better all the time. I agree. Yeah. So this is another. This is another part of our business. Um, this is a. This is what they call a direct to garment printer. We can do several hundred pieces a day, and and usually it's uh like we're doing some. What is this? Right now we're doing uh. Just a shirt that somebody ordered, has a picture on it, and we just print the picture. But we can do hundreds of pieces of this, and this just basically prints, prints the ink right onto the shirt. Um, very popular now. It's it's it's. Um, See all of that. This is a newer machine. It's about six months old. Oh, so how much is this one? This machine by itself is about twenty-five thousand. Um, these machines that go with it. This is a, a pre-treater. This is about five thousand. You know, about uh, this is another four or five thousand. So you're looking at about thirty-five thousand dollars worth of product, worth of machinery. I just want to ask you a few few more tips about the um, uh, logo. Okay. So, Riser, you've been dealing with so many logos, thousands and thousands of logos over the years. Give me some tips about the perfect logo. 
like uh, what it makes a perfect logo, the size, you know, give some tips or someone who maybe uh, just started a company and trying to work on all the branding items. Okay, so what I would say is you want to be under four inches long uh, width. Okay. okay. The height can be, you know, you want it to look nice but not overly big. So um, a four inches generally is a good logo. Yours is probably about three, two and seven. 2.75, I would say, which is good because of the size, the, 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 the writing that you have and the look of your logo, you can get away with not having it to be too big. Once you start to get over four inches or in that four inch range, sometimes the letters are too tall. You know, you have to use like perspective. So if that was a four inch logo, it would be pretty big on your left chest. Sure. It would be a little bit too big, I would say. So you want it to be clean. And, and I say the, 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 the quality of the stitching is really important. Sure. The, and, you know, the colors being, uh, uh, you know, you're, you're white on, on gray here, dark gray. So it, it pops nicely. Um, you know, I think, um, if you have a light colored shirt, obviously we'd go with a darker color, whatever your company sort of wants it to be. What mistakes do you see people do? Like, you know, tell me if you ever see a logo and you're like, man, you shouldn't do that. Or it's I think that the, the, a lot of times people try to put too much into their logo. They want it to do too many, they want to talk about their business too much in their logo. Like I've seen logos with like scenes, you know, scenes of things and scenery, it just, yeah. yes, scenery. And it's just some, it's not necessary. I think simple, simplicity is really important in your logo. We have about 23 employees, um, different sections. It takes about eight people to run this operation back here. So um, what's happening here? This is screen printing. So basically we have, a, we have three machines. Two of them are running right now. Um, we're, we're printing t-shirts and then on, on all the, on these two machines and this is the dryer. This is how the, the, after the stuff is printed, it comes out on here and it's drying. How much is this machine? This machine right here is about 50,000. This machine is about, I'll show you when you get around. This is about 110,000. And then we have some other machinery that's in here. We, Overall, we have about $750,000 worth of equipment here. And it's really done well. We have gas, so we have, uh, you know, this is a gas dryer, which is really the top of the line in dryers. Um, yeah, you just dried this shirt. For me, it was hot when I put it yeah. on. Yeah. You put it through here? Yeah, we put it through here. It just, you know, it, yeah. in 30 seconds, it's completely dry. The ink and everything, whatever is there, okay. it's dry. So this is a dark room. So what's happening in the dark room? So in the dark room, um, I can set this up. We have, uh, this is screens that we set up for each color. This is just a, uh, here, I'll show you that. Basically what we're going to do is we're well, going to set up. logo right there. Yeah, that's, that's a multiple color logo. And what we do is we print right onto the screens now. Used to be an old style way. This is the last few years. This is a newer type of technology where you're printing right onto the screen. So you don't have you don't have holes. You you have just really clean lines. Really important now to, you know, like I said, our quality is number one here. How much is this thing? This machine here is about thirty five thousand, and this machine is about ten. So, uh, it's it's not cheap, but the speed uh, the the speed of this and the uh, the overall savings to do the printing is, is much better. This thing prints um, at a much lower price than the old way, so much more efficient. Okay, so this is some of your shirts coming off the line right now. This is for your school, okay? So we just print some, this is, this is coming off of your, off of the dryer right now. We can do either. This cool. How many if you like one? Why don't we go over and, and, sure. and look from the, the other side where it's starting. So here we are. I, I can wash this all day. <laughs> so basically this is... Um, I think how many colors is this? Four? Five? Four? Four, four okay. colors? So this is four colors. See Max what you did? You complicated our logo for four colors. Four colors, much more expensive. <laughs> no, not really. 
So basically what they do is they printing each color separately. We could, we could zoom into that. Oh, he's doing the roofing insights too? Okay, so we're doing the roofing insights too. So this is just going around one time. It has to go down around twice. It prints white first, then it goes to the next step and it dries it, and then it comes and prints again. So if you want to come over on this side, so basically what happens here is your shirt that came around that was printed over there, it's, it's dried right here when the, when the shirt gets here. So it's going in there and this is called a flash dryer. So what happens is, is that flashes and dries, which makes it okay to print again. I see, so. so it has to be dry when you print on top of it. So when it gets over to the well, last- Why do you have to uh, do it twice again? Well, like because it has to have an underbase. So a lot of times there's multiple dryers and multiple colors and it can go around once, but on a smaller order, it only, it'll go around two times. It's no big deal to, to, to print it twice. We just changed this logo, you know, from the long one. This year was kind of like little rebranding. I wanted, I want a square one because long one, I could not put on many things, like right. even on the hat. You know, it's, uh, you're limited with a longer logo. Right. Like that logo, you cannot put it everywhere. Well, we stack it if it changes. Exactly. Yeah. So we just stacked ours, and I'm very happy yeah, how it looks on the I, I love it. I love your logo. It yeah. came out great. So she's getting ready to break it down. She's breaking it down now. And um, she's getting ready to do another logo. I think we're doing... Now the old school. Comment below, guys, which one you like better, that one or that one? And when you look at your logo now, if you remember the first part, it was it was kind of a dull white. Yes. And then the second time it hits, it's a nice bright white, real clean, and it's just a real uh, good looking logo now, nice and clean. Wow. So how do company set up account with you? What's the easiest way to do business with you? I know you have online stores, 10 minute tea. Mm -hmm. uh, is it the best website to go to? Because I don't want our audience to be confused. We have so many names, fully promoted. Right, right. Yeah. How do they do business with you? Where do they go? Where do they sign up? Where do they get the pricing? So what I would say is the best way to do it is to go through, if, so you're, in, if you're on the Roofing Insights page, you can find us on that page with the affiliate link with the affiliate link and then you can click through and just give us your information of the company and then we'll get in contact with you and we'll set up your logos and do all the things that's necessary to if you want to have an account with us like a regular account so like a uh, order order from that account with multiple pieces on there if you just want to do some hats or some polos or anything like that you could still go on the same website order on there and just go through pay and um, upload your logo that you have and you can just do it just like that on the 10 minute tea site we, we created a personal protection uh, equipment website and what we're doing is, um, like on your Roofing Insights, we'll add that to your products, and then you can order gloves, masks, um, uh, thermometers, whatever you guys need. I started doing that when this whole uh, COVID Cody. started. And the reason why is because it's just hard to find all that stuff, and you have a lot of uh, yep. places, everybody's, um, you know, coming at you from different angles and so. Love it, yeah. you can't beat that. Yeah, so we what we do is we try to add it to everybody's site while this is going on so that when they go on an order they can just grab some stuff on there i'll put everything in the description below so you guys know where to go we do have an affiliation program with the 10 minute key we don't get paid per square it's just that we promote their brand because we fell in love with them and we appreciate the sponsorship well we appreciate it too dimitri and it's really nice to have you in today awesome and look look forward to seeing you soon awesome